Hola, welcome to Cash and Spanglish. This is Sai from very sunny Puerto Rico. How are you doing? I hope you're having an amazing day. So today I'm going to be cash stuffing my sinking funds and my cash envelopes. I have $175 to stuff. As you guys know, I am low income, but also I am no longer stuffing my vacation envelope in this video because I now have a dedicated vacation binder and i'll be doing that separately so i did upload my first vacation binder video um this week if you haven't watched that go ahead and take a look at it um in that video i stuffed 910 dollars, which is what i had already saved for my vacation um in the past i don't know year or a few months so um today like i said i'll be stuffing 175 dollars i don't know if i said that but if not 175 let's count 20 40 60 80 100 20 30 40 50 60 65 75 so 175 dollars it is all here so starting out with my cash envelopes as always and this week in giving, I am adding $20. I still have $20 in there. I took out all the singles I had, um, but I do have to get this 20 and change it for singles because I like to have singles in my giving. Um, and I do not count this envelope. Gustitos is my self-care and it is getting $20. I have my nail appointment on Wednesday. It was on Monday, but I had to change it because something came up so i'm getting my nails done on wednesday they actually still look really good and they're almost i've had them for almost a month already and i feel like they look amazing for a month so gustitos now has 20 40 50 60 dollars that is awesome that is plenty enough my nails are 35 dollars either 30 or 35 depending on what design I get and I always give her a five dollar tip so Nieta is granddaughter she gets five dollars and this is to help out with her um fee for her school and it's I have 15 dollars now I give their her parents 20 dollars um every month to help with her schooling now mind you the schooling fees here are not that high she does go to a private school but it's a very affordable one regalos is gifts and regalos this week is getting ten dollars so it now has 10 20 30 35 40 45 40 six dollars are you guys done with christmas shopping um i'm pretty much done i only have the gifts that i'm going to give in cash and but those i just put them in a card or do a transfer um and then also one gift that i still haven't purchased because um my my husband my brother and i are pitching in because it's a gift it's a big gift for my mom so we're all pitching in for that and so we haven't purchased it yet um because it'll be delivered to her house um you know as soon as we buy it so we, we just want to wait till closer to, to christmas ropa is clothing did i stuff this already i don't think i did and it's getting ten dollars this week this will be depleted as always i bought a dress i couldn't resist myself i saw it it was so pretty and i needed a blue dress for a church event and so i bought it 10 20 25 26 27 28 dollars the church event is in January, um, but I already knew that I will need a light blue dress for that event because we're going to be um, using uniform. And so I just bought it. It was only $20, I believe. So Suscripciones is getting $20 this week. And why did I grab this? This is for my Microsoft. This is $100 for Microsoft. So... Suscripciones now has 20, 30, 40, 55. So $55 in Suscripciones. Um, and this is for Spotify, Netflix, YouTube Premium. Um, what else? I don't know what else I pay for subscriptions. I don't have that many. Miscellaneous, I'm using for my cell phone and I'm adding 
I've already started designing my envelopes for next year. I might just reuse these envelopes and just um, do, do something different with them. Um, but I might just reuse these because these are perfectly good. Like these are very good quality if I do say so myself. Of course, I made them. So why wouldn't I say that? <laughs> <laughs> but these um i've had them for a year and they still feel and look awesome like brand new so i just i'm thinking of reusing them but then um i'll show you what i'll do with them you know in the next few weeks so miseraneos now has 20 30 40 50 65 65 and this is for my cell phone like i said so i'm done with my cash envelopes Let's move on to um, sinking funds. Oh, this the closure thing here. It keeps getting caught on my envelope. And like I said, I plan to reuse these. So I hope it's well. If I need to make a new one, I'll make a new one. That's okay. <laughs> so Canva has not has it's getting five dollars as always i pay 120 for the yearly subscription and i pay it in september so canva now has 20 40 55 65 65 dollars halfway there better than halfway there that is awesome um emergency fund is getting 20 dollars this week And emergency fund now has five, six, seven, eight hundred dollars in the bank. Twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, ninety-five. So eight hundred and ninety-five. That is almost nine hundred dollars. My goal, of course, is one thousand for my starting off emergency fund. So. I am very close. I am very excited and proud of myself. Huracan is my hurricane emergency funds, and I am not stuffing this. This is fully funded. Now, I said in my last video that I might use this to um, finish my emergency funds, which I think I'm going to do because hurricane season starts in June and on November 30th. So we're already done with hurricane season. Thankfully, we did not get any hurricanes this year we did get a lot of rain and a lot of hurricanes were in our general area but they did not come directly to puerto rico which i am so grateful the lord is just so good with us so um since i have until june of next year um when the hurricane season starts again to um rebuild this I think I'm going to take $100 from here and put it in my regular emergency funds, complete that $1,000, and then just add to this within the next six months and rebuild it to $400, which is what I like to have here. Now, this I like to keep in cash because, and I've said this before, so I apologize if you've heard this before, when we had Hurricane Maria in 2017, I want to say, yeah, 2017, um, the power went out in the entire island. So Puerto Rico, the, the entire country did not have power and we could not access our money. Um, nobody had access to the ATMs. The banks were not working. There were no, there was no internet. There was nothing we could do to, for the people that had their money in the bank, nothing we could do to get to our money. And so I decided to have it in cash because if that ever happens again, I'll be prepared. I'll have money in cash to um, to be able to buy water or and gasoline for our generator and anything else we might need before we can access our money. Now, at least here in on my side of the country, because Puerto Rico is very small, but we had different experiences depending on which town or which area you were from here and on this side we did not have access to banks i believe it was for two weeks so from the hurricane until two weeks later we didn't nobody had access to atms or the banks because they were just not working they had no system no internet no power um so 
yeah, I don't, I, I'm trying to avoid have living that experience once again. Now, back then, I did have $200 in cash. I had the presence of mind to go the day before the hurricane was due to get here and um, get $200 from the bank. So for those two weeks, we lived off of that $200. And I don't know how God did it, but God made that money stretch like I've never seen money stretch before. Our generator... I um, used up $15 of gas every single day. And I had enough money for the generator. I also bought, I feel like I had bought um, water within those next couple of weeks after the hurricane because we didn't, that we had no running water. Um, so I, I'm telling you, I don't know how God did it, but God did it. And that money, those $200, they lasted those two weeks. So... Moving on, Mother's Day and Father's Day is getting, how much was it? I have my cheat sheet. $15. Yeah, I did $15 because I had like a random five in here and my tracker is in tens. And so I wanted to complete those $10 so I wouldn't have that random five. So Mother's Day and Father's Day now has 100 200 in the bank 20 40 50 60 70 75 80 180 280 my goal is 400 so i am well on my way with the mother's day and father's day i'll fill in my tracker later by the way this is a freebie if you want this just send me a message and i'll send it to you um so yeah my goal is 400 dollars for Mother's Day and Father's Day, and I'm very happy with my progress. So, Ojitos means eyes. This is for my lenses. Ojito is getting $20 this week. So, Ojitos now has 100, 200, 300 in the bank, 20, 40, 60, 80, 400, and 20. So, $420, which is really good. And finally, oh, P.O. Box. Oh, I forgot. So I'm going to do something different with P.O. Box. I am actually using my MasterCard rewards for my P.O. Box. Now, usually I would use my MasterCard rewards for Christmas, and I did that this year. But for next year, I'm doing something completely different for Christmas, um, which I'll show you in January. But I'm going to use my rewards for my P.O. Box. I think I have around $50 in my rewards already, but I'm going to be stuffing this with prop money just so that I keep track of how much is in my rewards. I just completely forgot today. I forgot to check how much I had in my rewards and I forgot to add the prop money. So hopefully I'll remember to do that next week. And last but not least is vehículo, which is vehículo means car. And this is for car maintenance. And it now has... 400, 400, 100, 200 in the bank. These are stuck together. I like to laminate these, but I just haven't had time. 200 in the bank, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 20, 40, 50, 65. 365, I am very happy with that amount. And that is it for this binder and also that is it for today's video thank you so much for being here i truly appreciate every single one of you thank you for spending time here with me if you haven't subscribed yet i hope you consider doing so and turning on the notification bell hit the thumbs up if you enjoyed this video leave me a comment below say hi i love to read your comments i will say hi right back to you once again Thank you, and I hope you have the most amazing and blessed day. Bye-bye. <laughs>